All right, coming up next, it's a middleweight matchup between Israel Adesanya and Nick Diaz. As he often says, I don't throw and hope, I aim and fire. His accuracy is on a completely different level than most of these middleweights he's facing. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if there's more where that came from. Boxing, boxing, boxing. I right, will no surprise the striker has come out at his aggressive best here early, really throwing everything with fight ending intentions. He's throwing everything to end the fight, and he has to, because the longer this fight goes, his opponent has the advantage. Watch knees to the body. Just over three minutes to go in our first round. Look at him working and trying to shut the liver down. Huge elbow there. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Watch right, so the taller fighter lands a knee, and Daniel Cormier to my right. I can hear him saying, I wish I was a little bit taller. He is all about that left kick to the body. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? That knee. Big that knee. knee hurt him. Oh, He's rocked. That was a beautiful hook. It landed perfectly, and it hurt his opponent very bad. A very nice leg kick there by Diaz. Oh, huge block! Right under the elbow, body the plant. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Big knee there. So, 100 minutes to go here in what has been a competitive and action-packed first round. That's a big strike right there. Overhand right, swing and a miss. Slips the punch. This might be. He's out. He got him. A near perfect strike to end the fight and end the night for his opponent, who candidly may not have even seen that shot coming. So just the way he drew it up, exactly what he told us during fight week, played out here on fight night. He found a little opening in his opponent's defense. Let's get it to Bruce Buffer now. 